Hello, welcome back. <laughs> we are still working on this beauty right here. And I have to, oh wow. It's like almost, oh, it's not almost dry. Um, it's very, this is the first time I'm using like medium, medium. Uh, the way I was taught in college was use like paint thinner plus like a linseed oil and I did that for a long time and then I just stopped and I really just used paint thinner <laughs> and I would like thin down my paints and use that and it would dry pretty fast. That's I guess not technically not how you're supposed to do it. So I'm back to using my medium which is always fantastic. And we are, we're gonna try and flesh out her face today, I think. Maybe. We might go back to the hands. I really am not sure. But I am pretty excited to see how my palette did. Oh no, it's still wet. Okay, cool. I got a little nervous because, like, what you saw in the time lapse I did of the palette. It's very thin, some of the areas that I mixed, right? So the thinner the layer, the faster it dries. Which normally is great on a painting. On my palette that I'm leaving out overnight, not necessarily what I want to do. But it's okay. Hold on. I realized. And then there was light. I don't know if it actually did anything. <laughs> Because <laughs> the sun is out right now and it's really bright in here, which is always a good thing. Um, I feel very like 80s with my socks like this. Oh my god, let's go to the gym. <laughs> I don't know why, why I did it this way, but I did. Okay, so we covered the palette. We covered that we're working on this beauty. The 31 day challenge is gone it's over it's done this is technically I guess the, the the final of it I do have a bunch of canvases that I want to paint over changing those okay yeah I don't know if I'm gonna work on those this month I went over oh, okay this is what I want to talk about I went over my goals I posted a video on TikTok on Instagram and I think I'm gonna put it on YouTube too of me going over my goals from January and reflecting on them and seeing what I did what I changed what I learned and then looking at February's goals so the first thing was doing the 31 day challenge which technically I did did I finish it technically I guess you could say no but it, that's cool I learned something really important for me I don't know if the challenge is great for me anymore. I think the first time I did it, it helped me so much. And maybe I felt like I needed to prove something. Now I'm at the mindset of I need to figure out what's best for me in order to succeed, I guess, in order to continue these great things these great habits that I have for a long time so doing 31 paintings and trying bigger canvases and pushing myself and burning out is not the best way to continue a YouTube channel to edit videos to make art make content um, you know do the accounting work do the the promotion work do the actual you know craft <laughs> so it's a lot and you know, I'm learning that it's okay to rest. Just something that I have a hard time with. Anyway, that was the first goal. Second goal was to make one second clips of my entire month of January to not just reflect on like all the artwork I do, but you know, I have a whole life <laughs> outside of art, which is great because you know, you can't put all your eggs in one basket. I have a wonderful family, I have a wonderful husband, I have a wonderful son. And we do things together. I have plants that I love. Yes, I'm gonna bring those up because they're my plant babies. And I also have a kitty cat who I love dearly and has been with me through some of my craziest times. <laughs> um, 
Yeah, I, yeah, he's a cutie. I keep him. He was actually just up here when I first started recording, trying to sleep on my laptop because the sun right now is on the floor and he's like, oh, they're warm. Anyway, what else did I have for January? Oh, it was uh, hanging up all the paintings because I didn't know how they like hang artwork up. So I thought it would be like the 31st, I have to hang up my stuff. No. So we're doing it February 5th, so that's okay. No big deal. Uh, I wanted to do a sale for February 14th. Like, I'm not really sure what kind of sale I want to do or if I'm going to do it. Maybe, you know what? I think I want to do like a story sale on my Instagram. I'm running ideas here. I haven't really announced anything. But looking around my studio and seeing how many paintings I have, and, you know, I have a lot still that I need to create. Um, maybe I'll have a story sale. A studio story sale. That would be fun. So, I mean, looking at all the things that I wanted to accomplish. Uh, I, I want to do more outreach and for my gratitude journal that I do. That I do. That I made. So I can journal. And not feel guilty. Look at this beauty. I mean, it's pretty. I love it. I'm not saying that just because I made it. Like, I'm actually using it, and it really, it really helps me. I'm the type of person who I told you I can't rest. So when I was journaling, and my old journal was great. My husband had given it to me as a gift. I didn't really like the layout. It didn't work for me. So I, I changed the wording and I made a layout for myself. So, some things I liked, some things I didn't, but a lot of the things that were draining my energy or enhancing my energy always seemed to go towards business. <laughs> so I didn't let myself even rest or really reflect as much on my like regular life, not regular, like, you know, your home life, your family life, whatever. So I, it was always like, I had a little bit of room and then I added something in there. And that's taken a lot for me to admit that I was like, oh, hey, I should probably write about my family. <laughs> Which, I mean, that just shows you where I was then and where I am now. So this honestly has helped me so much because I'm not allowed to put work here on this side. I'm not allowed to focus mostly on work and then, like, I have to analyze my family life and, and make that just as important has work because you only get one life right so you gotta make it gotta make it good anyway so that's me blubbering on for forever and procrastinating while also telling you how much i've improved <laughs> yeah that's the way the cookie crumbles anyway so let me get started it's actually lunchtime right now, so I, I'm not gonna get started. You guys are not gonna see that part, but I'm gonna go get my food. I'm gonna eat and then I'm gonna paint. I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise. Because I want to. Last night I was editing after midnight, so today I want to be like done by like seven o'clock, so I can enjoy the rest of my night. Maybe play some games with my husband. Uh, what did we get? We have Twister. We have Monopoly. But like we, it's Monopoly on the PlayStation, so it's it's easier than having the board out. Um, what other game? We got Villainous, the Disney one, which was pretty cool. Which I was dragging, I was dragging my feet and being a little bit of a biatch about <laughs> playing because it was really late and I was tired. And then he was like, No, 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 come on! And I ended up whipping his butt. <laughs> So he was like, I'm not going easy on you this time. <laughs> so anyway, let me go. Let me eat and then let me paint.
Hi. Hello. So, that's a lot. I did a lot today. Pretty, pretty excited about that. Um, let's see. The eyes, I'm loving, I'm loving this right here. This part is irritating me, but I know why. It's because I haven't rendered the nose, so it looks funny. Um, and once I flesh out the nose, I'll be able to flesh out this, like, this part of the face. That's like where the cheeks come in, so it's a little puffy. Um, so, and the mouth, so that'll be rendered. I am loving the hand, like this. Woo! That looks great to me. I just started kind of mapping out where this hand is going to be. So once I once I f like flush out the nose and the mouth, add a little more detail in with the hands, and fill this in. Uh, add a little more darkness here because it's a shadow. The breasts are becoming rounded there. So like this is the the top. That's it's going. It's going it's, this way so light hits it and now this part is coming down so it's going to be in shadow so I have to make that darker yeah and then I can go back and I think once it's dry I can basically put a light layer wash on top of where the um, so you can definitely tell where the steam is and where it has been wiped away so this part right here is going to be wiped away and then there's going to be, I think, like one or two other places maybe where the fingers are. And then a lot of it is like droplets. So I am, I'm digging it so far. I got to add, um, make the shadow a little darker here. That's another thing. I think at this point, I want to say it's about five hours in. Pretty cool, huh? See, this is supposed to be... Maybe her chin, I should bring this down a little bit. Maybe that's what it is. Mm, look at that, me figuring things out on camera. It's like I didn't even plan it. It's like I didn't even plan it. So this goes down, I think about here. Just so that I know for tomorrow where I want to do things. Okay, when this dries a bit more, I'll be able to add some lighter colors in there to give the chin appearance. This also needs to come down, I think, a bit. It would be cool if I finished it this week and then you guys could be like, wow, I watched a whole painting come together. Wouldn't that be something? That's about it. Have a wonderful creative day. Okay, subscribe for more art, follow me on my socials, and have a wonderful day. Bye!